a heel to elevated sink squat. So you grab the ramp, throw it under your heels and your feet. Barbell, start at lower than shoulder height. Just as you sink down, we've got to make sure that we're not shrugging up. All right, so what are we going to do? Get your foot contact, face the big toe and heel, and then you're going to shift yourself back to get heavier on the heel out moving the base of your big toe. Hook your arms into the bar here. I'm going to make sure my shoulders are unshrugged. I'm going to stay nice and tall. I'm going to get a full breath out. And as I do that, I'm going to tuck my hips underneath me slightly. So here we go. Slight tuck of the hips. Ribs are down. Abs are on. I'm still nice and tall. I'm going to inhale and drop down about a quarter away. Trying to keep the tuck of my hips. Once I get down about a quarter of the way here, I'm going to make sure that I'm not crunching it and shrugging up my shoulders. I'm going to stay nice and tall, heel heavy, keep the abs as I inhale. And you can breathe it out all the way. A little ab tension, keep the tuck of the hips, inhale. All the way out. When you come down, you want to first make sure that you establish the tuck of the hips so that you don't move backwards in this direction. All right, so once you establish everything rolling underneath you, everything's nice and stacked, you're gonna try to maintain that position of your body like you are moving in an escalator. You're going straight down in between your heels. Okay, I'm gonna repeat four, three, five sets of five reps. 